Everybody's talking about NFTs these days. You might be wondering how simple digital artwork or content is being sold for thousands and even millions of dollars, right? Well, in this video, we'll tell you what NFTs are, what minting is, and how you can start earning right away by offering your own original collection of NFTs in a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's begin. Oh, and don't forget to like and subscribe to Crypto Potato if you like our content. First, let's talk about what NFTs are. An NFT is a non-fungible token, which is a type of smart contract. From that reason, the most popular blockchain that interacts with them is Ethereum, which is the second largest cryptocurrency after Bitcoin. These special tokens can represent the legal rights of pieces of art. The most popular form will be images, photos, songs, and videos. For example, if you're an artist, you can sell your artwork as NFTs. Will anyone buy it from you? This is the question. But you might also want to know that NFTs of monkeys, known more as Bored Apes Yacht Club collection, were sold each for an average price of a few hundred thousand dollars. Now, let's explain another buzzword in the world, minting. Minting is the process of tokenizing a digital file with cryptography. Tokenization is the process of turning an asset into a digital token that can be moved, stored, and recorded on the blockchain. There's no rocket science behind minting NFTs, nor is there any coding involved. Every person with basic knowledge can easily learn how to mint NFTs. There are a lot of NFT minting platforms and marketplaces. In this video, we'll focus on OpenSea, the leading marketplace for NFTs. How can you mint your first NFT on OpenSea? OpenSea is the leading NFT marketplace, hosting the most popular NFT series like the Bored Apes. OpenSea is very intuitive and easy to use, and we'll see it now. Even though it's a quickly growing market, it's not a place for cash grab investors. NFT is not just about money. It's going to start a whole new tech revelation. As the metaverse will start developing more and more, the demand for NFTs will likely increase. We won't teach you how to get rich quickly through selling NFTs. However, we'll tell you how the OpenSea marketplace works and you can start minting and selling your NFTs in minutes. First, you have to connect your crypto wallet to the OpenSea platform. Use the link in the description and be aware of phishing sites. Those are sites that imitate the real site and their goal is to steal users' funds. Now, from the available wallets, MetaMask is the most popular choice for OpenSea accounts. If you don't have one, please use the link in the description and install it. MetaMask can also be integrated to cold storage wallets like Trezor and Ledger, and that's recommended for increased security. But in order to start, you can use it as a browser extension in Google Chrome, Firefox, or Microsoft Edge. Let's say you're using the extension. Once you've installed the extension, you can observe a small orange fox on the top right of your browser. Once you've set up the wallet on MetaMask, you can easily send and receive cryptocurrencies, mainly on the ERC20 Ethereum-based network but on other networks as well. Here's how you can connect MetaMask to your wallet. Go to OpenSea.io and click on the wallet icon located on the top right portion of the header bar. It will show you different wallets to choose from. Choose MetaMask and your wallet will be automatically shown on your OpenSea account. Provide OpenSea.io with all the permissions it requires to access your wallet. Then, the system will urge you to sign up. Once you accept the terms and conditions, you can easily access your funds directly on OpenSea without having to open your MetaMask separately. Click on Add Funds to either transfer funds into your account from a different crypto wallet or via debit or credit card. Once you've set up your MetaMask and OpenSea account, 
it's time to start creating NFTs. Go to your profile, click on My Collections, and then select Create. You'll find a form where you'll have to fill details like the URL of your collection on OpenSea, a description, category, and links to your website and social networks. You'll be prompted to enter your crypto wallet address. Click on the wallet icon and choose your address. The address will be automatically copied, which will have to be pasted into the required form. The great thing about this NFT marketplace is that whenever your digital asset gets sold ahead, you'll receive a certain share of profit. This is called royalties. If you decide to set it, you'll receive a cumulative payout of all of your royalty rewards at the end of the month. You can decide the percentage of royalty of your digital asset. For example, if you set the royalty of your digital asset at 10%, you'll get this reward every time your asset gets sold going forward. You can also choose whichever blockchain network you want to work with. In this example, we've used Ethereum. However, you can also use Polygon. This is a side chain, a layer two blockchain that separates workload from layer one blockchains like Ethereum and performs it separately, causing higher throughput and a lot cheaper fees. Okay. Now, choose the payment tokens that you permit to buy or sell your collection. So, here's how the minting and selling process works. The process of buying and selling NFTs is a lot simpler than you think. As for the technicalities, OpenSea has a pretty efficient AI algorithm that will help you keep track of your NFTs. Whenever you want to add an NFT to your collection, just hit add items at the top right bar of the collection section. You can mint different types of digital assets, including videos, audio, pictures, and 3D models as NFTs. It's important to name your creations to keep track of them. Then categorize your NFT by assigning it to a collection. You can fill in different details that describe your digital assets. For example, if I'm selling SpongeBob as a digital asset, I'll describe it as a spongy sea animated character with a large head and small feet. You can also set levels and stats for your NFT. Let's say if you have an NFT of a superhero, you can rate its strength, speed, or any other trait. And you wondered how much OpenSea profits from any sale on its marketplace? So OpenSea will charge 2.5% fees on every transaction. So that's all we have time for today, folks. If you've enjoyed this video and found it helpful, then to help more people hear about us, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos.